the sweetness lingers longer with Salati and Espresso. Welcome back to a very loveful, feel-good breakfast show here on SABC3. Now, I love Valentine's Day and all things Valentine's Day, but what's better than getting a personalized love note that just, you know, makes your heart go a flutter? What's even better is getting a personalized love note that you can eat. This morning, we're making love note cookies, and to do that, we got in my sister. She got all the looks, and I got the dimple. Caitlin Williams, how are you? Oh, we're very cute today. Oh, thank you. When we're together, we just bring that cuteness back to us. We're not the best in each other. So we're making love note cookies this yes. morning how do we make them and what do we need so um we, it's going to be a basic shortbread biscuit recipe yeah. so this is a great one to keep you know for special occasions when you can make biscuits because I mean, right. there's nothing better than getting biscuits i know i love a biscuit so, too the first thing we're going to start off with is some butter All and right. that's a little bit soft and then we've got we're going to use some salati caster snow the reason why we're using caster snow is mm -hmm. because it's got a really fine texture, okay. um, so it's going to dissolve easily into the butter, That's but good. without um, leaving granu a granular texture. Yeah, yeah, we don't yeah. want that. So you're going to just mix this. Um, you can do this in a stand mixer as yeah. well. But you know, if you're getting ready for Valentine's Day, mm. you want to get rid of all those extra calories. So okay. you know, want to use some arm work. All right. Just so you're just going to cream that together. Yes. Um, and, and that does help for the guns, hey? I mean, seriously, totally. I'm talking about the, the mm. muscles. Doesn't a man love a little bit of? In a firm <laughs> I would hope so. And then we're going to add the eggs. Right. I don't know if you want to start help cracking. You out there. And we're going to make them a beautiful red color. Okay. So I've got some Ooh, red food color yes, in here. Yes, I saw that. You can make them any color you want. If you want pink or blue or whatever your heart fancies. Okay. Or your special person's heart fancies. But it works for Valentine's Day to have red red cookies. Yes. And we're going to just mix and mix and mix okay. until that's going to come together. Like I said, it's really much easier to do this in a, in a stand mixer. Yeah. And then we're going to add our flour. Mm -hmm. It's quite a lot of flour. This is just normal cake flour. Don't worry about sifting. Yeah. Because you don't need air in it. Okay. And then mix, 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 and then it's going to come out like this. All right. So once you've done mix, that's what your dough looks yeah. like. So we're, now we're just going to roll it out. We've got some cute little cookie cutters over there. The ones I have today are quite special because you can actually write little notes oh, in them. Oh, that is so cute. Yeah. Wow. So and do, it, they, do they come like this already? Well, you, and then you, you just get, get like a whole bunch of yeah, letters. You get letters that you slot in. So you can actually make them personalized. So you could put Leanne on there. Oh. Or be mine or whatever. Nice. I like it a lot. Exactly. Right. So we're going to roll this out uh, just with a little bit of flour. So it's about half a centimeter thick. Okay. And then we've got one here that says. You make my heart crumble. Oh, nice. Or you make me crumble. And then it comes out like oh, that. Look at that. How cute. Okay, we have and to show this. And then we're going to put that on a baking tray and bake it at 180 degrees. There we go. You make me crumble. So cute. And I mean, if you don't have the letters, you can you can do it by hand as well. Okay. And then we've just got some, you can use a royal icing that mm -hmm. you can make with the salati icing sugar, which yeah. is egg whites and icing sugar. Mm -hmm. Or over here, we've got some chocolate that I just co colored with a little bit of food coloring. And just sort of pipe a little border around the edge and just make it look pretty. Oh. I love that. Yeah, and then I've also got some edible glitter because, nice. you know, a little bit of glitter. Well, if you would like the, the recipe for what we've just made right now and all of the different steps involved, all you have to do is SMS the word Salati to 33728 and we'll gladly send you your pick and pay shopping list as well as the link to the recipe. And what's nice is five people are going to walk away with a Salati hamper this morning that has a whole lot of amazing Salati sugar stuff in it as well as an apron as well. So that's pretty cool. All you have to do is SMS Salati. So we pop this on here mm. and then, oh, that is Marianne, so cool. you know that you're the icing on my biscuit. Oh. <laughs> that is so, I, I have nothing to trump that. I, I don't. I don't. And then we we've just packaged them packaged them in a cute little box. We're just nice. gonna we've got some little cookies here. They're wrapped just so that you can keep them airtight so they don't go soggy. Awesome. Stuff. In a little box. That is How so cute. cute. That is very very cute. But you know what? Hey, I think that as somebody that loves Valentine's Day just as much as we do is Bob. And I'm gonna see if he, if I can try and get him to take this to you. And but before we do that, if you missed any of the steps in our love our love note cookies, all you have to do is just check this out. Mix together butter, sugar, vanilla and food coloring, then beat until light and fluffy. Add eggs and mix well. Stir in flour and mix until a firm dough forms. Wrap and cling and refrigerate for one hour. 
Roll dough out, then cut into desired shapes. Bake at 180 degrees until the edges have browned. Cool before icing. Come on, Bobby. Bring me those cookies. Oh, look how sweet is that. Even Bob's get into that Valentine's Day spirit. Thank you, my boy. Thanks, guys, in the kitchen. This looks lovely. Mons. Okay, now Vicky made Matana Cat says on skins. Um Matana says on skins directory by Express and say three ongelooflike tafel on my car geslaan. And this is maybe what you even on can do on my unforgetable atmosphere to skip Matana. How are you? I'm good, thanks. And you? Good. Look at Bobby. He brought us those so cookies. Cute. So you must place it Adorable. somewhere on this beautiful table. But you're gonna give us some great ideas now as to as to you know. How can people recreate this at home? Because this looks stunning. Thank you. So we all know the story of St. Valentine, who basically was imprisoned for believing that everybody deserved love and happiness and deserved to be able to get married if they wanted to. Yes. So what better way to embrace his whole belief than to show a table setting that is traditionally Valentine's Day yes. okay, for cool. the occasion. So we kept it really simple and all the beautiful elements on the table today are all from pick and pay. And we started with a beautiful dark red tablecloth. And you know, then the colour of love. Exactly. <laughs> and we've got a beautiful white lace table runner that we've played with different kinds of lace and sizes. Uh -huh. And then Pick and Pay has brought us beautiful red and white roses. We have strawberries dipped in chocolates for the true you know, romantics. That's, that's probably one of my favourite things, strawberries dipped in chocolates. <laughs> Yeah, and we have these beautiful um, red candles from Pick and Pay as well. And we've got Pick and Pay's beautiful range of Valentine's Day chocolate in boxes and small little hampers that is the perfect gift to give to the one you love. So this is it. It's actually very simple. Everything is available at one spot. So you can just go and you can create this. How, how long did this take you? I mean, uh, how long? Did, what does it take to put something like this together? You know what, I think always keeping it simple and working with, okay, we're going to choose red and white, two colors, and then you build up from there. So as long as you're sticking to the theme and the colors as your guide, it's really simple to put it together. I mean, we've just used some beautiful silver teapots and vases to display the roses in and, you know, the same thing with the plates. And yes. then just use white doilies that are available at any pick and pay and use that to layer to help tie in with the lace. So there's very simple things that you can do to really make it come alive and come together and embrace it. And it's also a perfect setting for couples to combine their Valentine's Day and do it together. Exactly. So maybe, you know, three different couples would sit down and have a lovely meal together. So there's many things you can do to embrace the whole theme of Valentine's Day and enjoy it. Oh, it looks stunning. Thank you so very much. And on the topic of roses, there's a rose Aww, for you. Happy Valentine's so Day, Matana. Here we go. You. Lots more Valentine's cheer coming to you on this lovely Thursday morning. We're going to go to a quick ad break. Don't go anywhere. By supporting the Flower Valley Conservation Trust, that's where we found goodness. Pick and pay, always there for you.